Hi, I'm Sunil. Do you know what's a good place to find images? Videos. Yes, videos are essentially moving images. So if you're able to grab a still or a frame from a video, you have a high quality image that you can use inside your slides, inside reports and whatnot. In fact, all the thumbnails that I make for the Clip YouTube channel are essentially stills that I grab from videos I made. And I'm gonna show you the tool that I use to grab those stills. This is the tool I use to grab images from a video. Uh, it's called the Capture Still Image from Video Tool, and it's on the outclip.com website. The link to this tool I will include in the description. Uh, it, it's very simple. There is a single button on the website called Open Video to open the video file. Let's click that, and I will select a video file. And this is going to load the video in uh, this browser, and I can play the video. So I can also jump to the exact location where I want to grab the, uh, the image. So let's say I want to grab something at this frame. Um, so this is about 54 seconds into the video. Uh, so I can, I can just click around here on this timeline to kind of roughly select the location. And if I want to do any fine control uh, of the specific time, I can use this numerical input, which says capture still at this timestamp. So at 54 seconds, or I can go up, hundred millisecond steps further or even backward uh, in the video. So let's say I want to grab this particular image. Um, and so once I'm happy with the time, I can just click capture. And this is going to download the, the image of that frame on my computer. So here's an image that was downloaded and I'm going to click open. And here's the image. You can zoom in and see. So this, uh, image has the exact resolution of the video. Um, now let's go back here. So it's a fairly simple tool. You open the video file, you can click to select uh, the location in the video where you want to grab the still, and then you can fine tune it and then click capture and you have a file on your computer. To wrap up a few additional details on the tool, uh, the tool accepts video files of up to two GB in size, which is fairly large. Also, the tool operates entirely within the browser, so nothing's uploaded or downloaded, which makes it really fast. And it can accept video files of varying formats. So you have a lot of flexibility in the kind of videos you can extract images from. So I hope this video was useful and you can use this tool to capture still images from videos. Thank you for watching. Bye.